Welcome everybody to God, Family, and Bikes. Uh, many of you know that I'm preparing to do uh, some racing this season. Um, so I was looking over my bike, trying to get her all into shape, pulled the uh, air filter out. And, uh, and then I went back and remembered that I added this Enduro Engineering end cap on because I needed a spark arrestor to be legal where I ride. Um, kind of a bummer that KTM doesn't just include this with their bikes, especially the 300 XCW, which is a, designed to be a trail bike. But anyways, I, I went with the end cap because it was only about a hundred bucks um, over a turbo core muffler. Um, so I put it on there. One of the downsides was that people said that it builds up and clogs the exit um, and doesn't let uh, exhaust flow. So I'm gonna take a look at that. Uh, I thought I'd get away with it because it's a TPI bike and they run kind of lean. So I figured that it wouldn't gum up too bad, but I'm gonna take the end cap off and take a look and see how bad uh, it's actually gummed up. So uh, let's take a look. So I got about uh, 65 hours on this bike and I put this thing on pretty much from the beginning, maybe a few hours less, but uh, we'll pull it off here and see what it looks like in here. Nice thing about this, uh, they do come off with just uh, two Allen head screws here. Um, get that lined up. I don't know, maybe I should have got out of this, at this before 65 hours, but that's what I put on it. So we can, uh, ooh. Yeah, you can see that's uh, really built up with crap. Um, so we'll pull it out and uh, clean it off. But as you can see, that's, uh, I mean, you can't see the, through that at all. That's, that's pretty restricted. All right, in addition to the screen being all clogged, you can see that this is uh, built up quite a bit in these uh, grooves in the cap. So I'll get some solvent and toothbrush and work all that out of there. But man, there's, there's significantly more buildup than I thought there would be. Maybe my expectations were a little off. All right, after a little bit of scrubbing, we got the end cap all cleaned out, but got the screen so where you can actually see through it now. I guess uh, lesson learned here is 65 hours is way too long to let this go. Um, probably gonna look at cleaning this every 15, 20 hours, um, see if that uh, that's better, because it was completely clogged at 65 hours. Now what we're gonna do is uh, slap this back together and the bike should run significantly better. Got the end cap cleaned out too. So we got the end cap back on there, all cleaned out. So uh, we should be able, ready to race next Saturday. Um, glad I found that um, so that I can get it cleaned out before that race um, next Saturday. If you haven't been watching my channel, I am gonna start racing this season. So if you'd like to watch me and see how well I do or don't do, um, remember to hit the subscribe button and follow along. Uh, but I uh, hope you enjoyed watching me put that end cap back on and clean it out. Remember, if you buy one of these, clean it out more often than 65 hours. Um, yeah, hope this helped. God bless.